really unfortunate that uh, that our night had to end so abruptly. I know. I'm really sorry. It's all good. Uh-oh. At least let me see that dress one more time before I leave. Uh-oh. I mean, that's the least you can do, right? Okay. Gonna pull the guy out on her. <gasps> yeah! Yeah! Catch a Freeman TV. We are back with the part two of True to the Game, part two. You know what I mean. I'll specify it so you don't get confused and I don't get a bunch of dislikes for finding the wrong video. But we are back here. This is Gina leaving uh, to go to LA, right? Because she got a new job, a little internship. So um, let's do it. Let me just let me hit play. Hope it sounds good. I'm trying to hook up everything. Got the green screen behind me. Let's get it. Got the mic in my hand so you can hear me. I'm going to turn them. You know, let's get it. Okay. So she was trying to have the, the dude was about to have help her with the bags. But she was like, nah, I'm good. I got it. Because she got all that money in the, in the green bag. Okay. Gina's still sexy. I see you. She's still sexy. All right. Go ahead, Gina. Hold on, what's she whipping? What happened to the... Oh, she got a Range Rover now? What happened to the uh, the pen she had? Okay. She got the Range Rover. You drive a Range Rover. You a big dog. Yeah, big dog. Oh, uh, is that Tamar? Tamar, what you doing in this? Who that, Grandma? Go ahead, Grandma. Cut them, cut them. Okay, there go Vivica. Okay, she's still healing with Grandma. I'm sorry, I'm hungry. I was about to go get me something to eat till you gave me that 911 call to get over here. Well, I got some baked chicken on the stove and mm. some broccoli and some mashed potatoes and mm. it'll be ready in a few minutes. Mm. That's what I'm talking about. Let me get my hot sauce. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Cook it up, Grandma. So what's going on? <sighs> Baby girl did not just pour hot sauce what out the pocketbook. Maria? Maria? What's she doing? It ain't any one thing, but she got this air of disrespect. She been disrespecting you? Not per se, but uh -oh. I did have to use my hands on a few weeks ago. Get, get. You can't be laying your hands on these kids nowadays. It ain't like when we was growing up. Hold up, pause. Oh, Why not? That's grandma. That's big mama. That's Nana. You get out of line with Nana, Nana pop you. What's the problem? See, here we go. Here we go with this new, new... Uh, uh, this new era of thinking. I'm not trying to hear it, Vivica. I'm not. Go ahead. I'm gonna let us go ahead. Press play. I, ain't gonna... I know that. I know it. I ain't trying to go to jail, baby. Oh, and that's why I've been trying to just keep this level of restraint since then. But I don't know how long I can keep this up. That's why I want you to talk to her, cause you two are tight. It's true. They tight cause they Where's trapped now. Huh. Say she in the gym, but ain't no telling. Sure, please talk to her. No, it's crazy. What? Oh, yeah, she's a good she role model because she's out here in trapping. About being overly protective. Get out. But she didn't say nothing about you laying no hands on her. Hmm. She better not either because if she knows what's good for her. Stop that. Go ahead, Grandma. No, I ain't supposed to be saying stuff like this. <laughs> but girl, I'm worried. I'm worried about her. And I don't want her to go down the same path as Gina. Speaking of Gina, how's she doing? Pause. Me... See, this is my this is my issue. You didn't want her to go down the same path. Let me get close and talk to you real quick. Yeah, you you watching? You didn't want her to go down the same path as Gina. You wouldn't allow the bullshit to perspire. No, your drug dealing boyfriend can't come over here. You can't date him. If you date him, I'm gonna throw your ass out, and I hope you can live with him. It's just that simple. It would have been that simple. You want to follow in her footsteps? I throw your ass out too. So if he's a drug dealing nigga, you really he really love you that much? If he got the big money and all that, he'll let you stay with him, and then y'all go about your business. But we had a we got an old saying in, in in my family, and it's called "Not in my house." Is that it was just that simple? Uh, but I I ain't even gonna, I ain't even gonna go there yet. Go ahead. She in California and working. Say she don't ever want to come back to Philly because of all the bad memories. 
Okay. And I'm worried about her. Mm. I don't want to lose Bria like I lost Gina. Mm. Especially now that she got that new boyfriend. Hey, 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 hey. Uh-oh, she got a new boo? I'm going to talk to Bria for you. you Who got a new boo? Is she talking about Gina or is she talking about Bria? Oh, thank you, girl. Mm. We do a movie review. I got to remember all their names. Got Get, Suge, Bria, Gina. I'm going to make sure. It's my pleasure. I like dark meat, okay? I know. Austin. She said she like dark meat. Vivica, <laughs> watch out. Babe. Oh, is that the new boyfriend? Remember when we first hooked up? And I told you I wasn't looking for anything. What? Yeah, uh -oh. you said you didn't want a relationship. I'm, look, I'm still with that. But if for whatever reason we wanted to modify that. Modify? Yeah, like if one of us got in our feelings and thought that maybe we should make our relationship exclusive. <laughs> Look, I, I'm, I think it's worth a try. Pause. Here we go. Here we go. For some reason. You know what? I'm a reserved judgment on homie. I don't know what he's about. But it's very interesting. We have now, <laughs> we have now a culture where girls are now, you know, it's funny. Back in the 90s, guys would be running away from commitment. Now here we are, 20 years later, 30 years later, we got girls running from commitment. Is that like, is that, is, is that what y'all wanted the ball in y'all court? Is that what's going on? Like, is this, why, why do we gotta play these games? It's not wrong, it's not wrong with a person being in a relationship. Now I will say he is going out of foul, he is, he is going out of line because he said when they started, no, no strings attached. So you know what? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him, I'm gonna give her a break because he's switching up the script. But let's see what she say. You see, she about to get up and damn near leave now. Now he, he want a relationship. Go ahead, I'm gonna let it go. So you're saying that you're into your feelings and you want to be exclusive? Wow. <laughs> I'm telling you, I'm keeping it hundred with you, unless you know where I'm at. Everything. Hmm. Nice. All right. So nice that you want to be exclusive. No, nice that you're keeping it a hundred. That's it? I mean, I was feeling like it was all good, but now I'm not too sure. Uh-oh. Wait, 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 wait. What happened? What's, what's going on? It's a wrap. She just wanted the D and keep it moving. My girl now you lost the whole thing. Besides, I don't have time to be complicating myself with all these extra feelings and shit. Look, Rhea, I don't know what happened, but I, I like you, all right? And I like you, too. And if you want to kick it, I'm with it. But all this extra shit, I don't have time for it. You got your answer. I'm sorry, um, you can kick it. I'll hit you up when I want to kick it again. That's it. It's just that simple. Fuck. You ask once, maybe twice. I've been there. She don't want what you want. Just chill. Uh oh. Cause it's better. It's better. Yo, I'm telling you, fellas, don't don't play yourself. Cause some girls will run from your ass. They see that you're trying to start a relationship. Just just chill. Or you're loser altogether. Hey, what's going on, man? Forgot your umbrella, huh? Uh, yeah. <laughs> You know, actually, I was coming to meet my uh, my cousin, Gina Rollins. You seen her around? Oh, no, she took off. She's driving to L.A. She already went to L.A.? She's on her way. Oh, crap. And my cell phone is completely dead. Can you be a good friend and help me out? Um, otherwise, I'll be lost. <laughs> okay. Um, do you need to... I mean, I have her itinerary. If you... Would... Are you serious? Yeah, that's... You'd be a lifesaver. I hate to do this to you, but I don't have my glasses. Um, no, that's fine. So if you can just read that off. Yeah, of course. Okay. Cool. Two zero nine two eight Pacific Coast Highway, Malibu. Thanks a lot, buddy. All right. Yeah, you got really? it. Really? Yeah. Okay. Tell her I said hi. I will do. All right. Uh, Gina's cousin, right? He didn't even get his name yeah. on her dad's side. How you give somebody there a whole itinerary? You 
crazy as hell. You drive to L.A.? Fuck Yo, that. That's like a weak like drive. Says, but everyone's still on edge. It's Philly. People are born on edge. Yeah, but the police is harassing the trap houses, asking about Rasan. They just going through the motions, trying to justify their paychecks. I know, I know. But uh, I think it'll put everyone at ease if you slide through. It ain't gonna happen. I'm in L.A. I'm blending in with the Cali folks. L.A.? I just left you in New York. What are you doing in L.A.? Gina Rollins. Gina Rollins? You really don't think she got bread, do you? Well, let's see. Did this dumb nigga really just drop the body on the ground with no gloves and he's touching his phone? She lives on Park Avenue and drives a Range Rover. What do you think? You think she got a sponsor? Nah. She doesn't really give me that vibe. <laughs> now you got a vibe on her, huh? Nigga, I ain't out here for shits uh -huh. and giggles. What you working on? Shit, just tying up some loose ends with Jordan. Man, I just found out where they're doing the memorial lap. I got eyes all over it. All right, well, let me know what you find. All right, one. I'll let you. Do niggas still say one? Who say Who say that? Who say Nobody say one when they hang up. In 2005. Bedrooms have the exact same view. Mesmerizing, isn't it? It's incredible. <sighs> I'd like it. The key, garage door opener, and my card in case of an emergency. Okay. Oh, and there's a store five minutes up the way if you need groceries. Okay. So what do you do for fun around here? I personally play volleyball. Volleyball? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't played volleyball since I like I was volleyball. In high school. Really? Yeah. Well, if you haven't played volleyball in a bikini on the beach next to the Pacific Ocean, you really haven't played. Yeah, LA. That is play that now, you'll play volleyball right? in LA. Yeah. If you're interested, let me know. I stay just up the road. Okay. Uh, uh, white boy trying to shoot a shot. Go ahead, player. Okay. Well, call me if you need anything. We'll do. Thanks, Mark. Let me find out Gina out here swirling. I I ain't even gonna go there. I ain't gonna go there. Something Everybody drive and fly. He got the Porsche. The model bull got the Mercedes Benz. She got the Range Rover. Okay. Looking back to see how far I've come. Rest in peace. I fight Trap to nigga overcome. Quadir. The struggles of my past. I did like his character, though. He was a cool. He was a, like a, a cool dude, but you know. Every if you seen the last review, there was some things I was like, whatever. But, you know. It's the whispers that the universe will speak. So rise to you. Rise to your truth. Rise and be true. Okay, I'm glad that didn't carry on that long because they were starting mm. to lose me. That feel good? Yeah, it feels good as fuck. You got a lot of tension in your neck. Who that? You want me to relieve that for you? Turn around. Oh. Oh, that's a uh, little. Oh, little mama worse than messing with the with the model ball. Okay. So. What's all this stress about? Mama. Can't be that bad. I mean, my man's got hit for every bit of coke we had. Is that bad enough? Well, maybe I was wrong. Y'all know who did it? No, nah, all we know is that just a bunch of bitches. Uh-oh. Bitches? Like girls? I mean, is there any other kind? Shit. We ain't even worried about it. Uh-oh. We're gonna figure it out like we do everything else. It what was her and Bria. Some bitches and their family, they're gonna feel uh -oh. it. 
That's on God. That's on God's cuz. That's on God, cuz. Oh, Gagat, you in church? Oh, that's right. They ain't even had the funeral yet. That's her right there. You sure? Positive, my G. Faith Evans? Okay, okay. I don't mean to be a uh, racist, but I Did love how black this movie no. is. I don't want to And I didn't authorize that song. Well, you don't get to authorize it. You just get to enjoy it. Oh yeah, that's a uh, Quadir's mama. You got to see the first one. You can't just come here. You got to see the first one before you see this one. She'll come in? Nah. She say why? She just laying low for a minute. And she said this is a ploy for Quarter's mother to get some attention. Quarter mm. is gone. We just need to keep him in our hearts. I know that's right. This nigga, this nigga really smoking in the feet. Ignorant Nick. <laughs> Security. I'm doing a eulogy. Uh oh. Hey, everyone. I'm so glad that all of you could make it to celebrate my son's life. He was a good boy, a good man. I wonder if they show how old I've been he is. Going back and forth the last few days trying to figure out the right things to say. And now I don't know what to say. She lied. Except I'm glad Gina sent Faith Evans to sing because she expressed okay. my sentiment. Damn, it doesn't say how old he was. thugs in this movie look like male models i mean come on man who what thug really what rocks that come on man i i, I ain't gonna i ain't gonna go there well i guess he in la so he gotta look the part right all right yeah, that's fine nigga don't look like no thug you like a goddamn black abercrombie and fitch model Damn, Gina didn't even go to the funeral? Hmm. Okay. to hold the money. If this man guessed the password, I'm done.
thugs so thugs got access to tracking devices now so okay. beyond the 20 acres right. of land that we are developing for I harvest I ain't gonna we're go also creating designer strains like the one you saw yeah oh, gina okay that's nice so will i be meeting mr sanchez after the tour mr sanchez doesn't run the day-to-day -day operations of the farm but he did want to make sure that you got a thorough tour Okay, I pasa, mama, will I actually be meeting Mr. Sanchez? Uh, we would have to get back to you on that, but it'll be soon. Soon? Very soon. She now, lied. let me show you our brand and packing facility. Time to go get groceries. Why the fuck would you drive a Range Rover from New York all the way to LA? That's crazy. You wanna I would preserve that car. Just fly, mama. You know what? No, she couldn't fly because the cash needs to be in an account. So she just said, fuck it, I'll drive. That makes sense. Uh oh, they about to holler? Yo, hey girl. Hey. Uh -oh. Well, me and my friend made a bet. It's this range is yours or your boyfriend's. Does that bet mean you hit no uh -oh. me? You don't want to know what I guessed? No, I just want to pump my gas. Yo, all we were trying to do is talk. Yo, you drawing right now. I'm just trying to pump my gas. Thank you. Fuck her, bro. Gentlemen, uh -oh. gentlemen. I have a strange feeling the lady is not interested. So we're going to keep things respectful and just keep it moving, right? Okay. Thank you. Uh, sorry about that. And a lady should not be pumping her own gas. Oh, I'm good. Thank you. Okay. You sure? I'm sure. All right. Well, at least let me give you a business card. Thank you, David. Take a couple in case you need it. <laughs> I don't need five. I got, I got one. Well, I'll give you six. <laughs> okay. What's your name? Gina. Gina? Nice to meet you, David. Pleasure's mine. You're definitely not from here. No. Where are you I'm from? Not. From Philly. Philly. Okay. Well, welcome to LA. Maybe I'll see you around, Gina. All right. When did this nigga find time to change clothes again? Was this the next day or something? Yeah, wouldn't that be some bullshit he ended up smashing? Gina? That'd be some shit. So I'm talking about baby girl. Stay in shape. Stay in shape. Hey. Hey, it's Mark. Did I uh did I catch you at a bad time? Just doing my morning Probably tai chi. Time. You want me to let you get back to that? No, no, no. It's fine. What's going on? Group of friends are gearing up to Coldplay Volleyball. Wanted to know if you wanted to join us. Come get that workout in. Hello? Gina? Yeah, yeah, I'm here. Okay. Sure, shoot me the address. Yeah, I'll send it to you now. Uh, we're five minutes down the PCH. Okay, I'll see you in a little bit. Yeah, sounds good. Oh, she about to end up smashing the white boy. You know it ain't a it ain't a real movie unless it's unless, unless the main character has sex. You know what I'm saying? So she going somebody gonna get them cookies. I could be wrong. <laughs> that was that was not that. What do you mean? I, just, I, I saw you out there. You killed it. Whatever. They skipped. I would like to see her play volleyball. They skipped that. They're just dicks. No, it was fine. No, really, I had a really good time. Yeah? Yeah. So did I. But, just so we're clear, just, no, I'm not a dick like those guys. No, you're not a dick. In fact, you were a perfect gentleman. Wow. Good. Thank you. Had a great time, though. Me too. See? Thank you.
So, do this again soon? Sure. Yeah? But I picked the sport this time. Perfect. Bowling. I love it. Bowling? <laughs> I, I'm good at bowling. No. Thank you. What? They got Gina swirling? I ain't, I ain't gonna go there. So you go. So, so pause, pause. So let me be. Let me be. Let me be. Let me get this straight. So when my boy Quadir, the black brother, tried to holler at you back in your own city, you was giving him the hard time. He called you a queen, all that, right? He called her a queen. How you doing? Trying to holler, da da da. Gave her the hard time. But the white boy from LA don't know nothing about him. He gets the easy time. He gets an easy pass. He got the number. Very interesting. So the white boy, maybe she's making, maybe she's making a change. Like, all right, he not a drug boy. He a white boy. He from LA. So maybe that's what it is. Maybe she was like, you know what? I'm not gonna do the criminals anymore. I'm a nice little kind gentleman white boy. Very interesting. Okay. It, it it don't make sense. It doesn't make sense. You went from the black gentleman trap boy, you was giving him a hard time, and then you all of a sudden are inter interested in a white guy from LA. Very interesting. I'm, I ain't, I ain't, uh, once again, I ain't gonna same go there. from the picture is the same girl that robbed us? 100%. They was all at the memorial together. You saw them at church together? Yeah, it was a nice memorial too. There was a couple celebrities in there. Faith, Stevie J. All right, all right, nigga, I got That's the point. Hilarious. Well, he, 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 he hating on this man, he dead. Uh, Ain't there some shit still hating on him? was like, old, old. And Gina used to live with them. It's her cousin and her grandmother. I think Gina set the whole thing up. So he was right to follow her out to LA. Well, find out who the third chick is before you make uh -huh. any moves. We don't want to scare them away. Yeah, I bet. Hi. I hit you back. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. White boy about to get tuned up. You don't know Gina Rollins. Excuse me, who are you? It's not important. What is important is that you do exactly what I'm asking. You don't contact her, you don't text her, you don't know her, understand? Look, I don't know you. Last time I checked this America, I... I'm only gonna ask you this one more time. Stay the fuck away from Gina. I'll do whatever I want. Stay the fuck away from Fuck. Listen. Huh? You wanna talk? <laughs> fuck you gonna... Fuck you gonna do, huh? The fuck away from her. Sheesh! <coughs> Damn! Fuck, man! Uh -oh. Stop! Damn! All the boyfriends is getting beat up. He pretty much dead already. What you punishing me for? Punishing? I could get medieval. But I Look, check this out. You got two options. Life. Uh, okay, okay. It was, Bria wasn't even really checking for me. Mm -hmm. She was using me for sex and food and whatever. And for the right price, I'll push that skinny bitch off the bridge. I mean, are you serious? Hold on. Pause. Pause. Are you serious? Who in the fuck would get their ass beat in the trunk like that? Wouldn't you try? Even if you are scared to fight, wouldn't you try to maneuver the... Get up out of that trunk? What, you just gonna stay there and get punched in the mouth? You're not even tied up or nothing? Wh where they do that at? I, I'm not go I'm not gonna do it. I'm not gonna do if it. Do take off. Sure. Two coats. Hi. Two buffalo cheese. Hey, how you doing? Can you give me one second, please? Sure. Two coats. Okay, he'll be ready in 10 minutes. What name should I put the order under? Okay, thank you. I'll see you in 10 minutes. Good day. How you doing? How may I help you? Yeah, I had called in the order for Gina. One second. 
Gina Rollins? Yes. Yep. Right here. Is that would be fourteen thirty three. Oh, I pay for it by credit card over the phone. Now, if I ain't know any better, you did. I think that you were following me. Uh -uh. Gina, right? Yeah. David. Yep. You got any bad guys you need me to run away? This nigga got that dress yeah, game on point, sure? boy. He don't play. Yeah, I'm sure. But I will tell you, you guys in L.A., you're a little different. No. Not all guys in L.A. are the same. And I would love to show you that if you just use the number on that card I gave you. Offer still stands. You know, I just might hold you up on that offer. Okay. Right. I just might like that. Okay. Yo, if he end okay. up smashing... Well, um, um, that's gonna be a crazy plot right you do there. The same, Gina, David. Ladies, if a nigga say your name like that and you don't even know him like that, don't don't do it. Don't do it to yourself. Mr. Sanchez. Oh, Mr. Sanchez. Gina Rollins. So nice to finally meet you. I admire all of your accomplishments. Such a pleasure. Did you get everything you needed? Yes, I did. Daniel emailed me everything. Then I guess we're good. Would you care to join me? Sure. Man, this nigga a drug lord. Okay. Recording. Why his house kind of look so, like that house from Bad Boys 2 when they when they broke in the house? Um, in the, the cartel houses. people. Y'all remember that? I'll put a picture in there. It look like it kind of remind me of that. Yes, but it was because of your support that the law was passed, right? I'm sure I answer that as well. Okay, so you were born poor in Mexico. What was... Let's not talk about these nonsense issues, uh -oh. huh? Ask me what you want to ask me. I'm sorry? Your nonsense issue? Everyone knows. I'm rich. I'm powerful. Uh -oh. Ask me what you want to ask me. I knew Quadir. You knew Quadir. Oh, that is the My drug friend. lord from the first one. Wanted to meet the That's, that was the plug. The That's right. Friend. God rest his soul. But how? Why? I don't. I don't understand. Quadir was a very good friend of mine. That's that. right. The last time mm -hmm. I saw him was the last time you two were in California. Uh, I've never right. seen him so happy. <laughs> He was a good man. Was he though? So that's why I'm here? Yes. To ask questions that I might have answers to. Uh -oh. Help you fill in the blanks. To ease your mind with any information that I might have about him. Have you been sending me packages? And I'm not talking about the press packages. Uh -oh. Why am I here? What do you mean, why are you here? Because oh, they got my boy Eddie from Family Matters. <laughs> it's a big Come day for you, man. Big day for you. You're doing big things in the street, huh? Uh-oh. Yeah. But you know what? I can't seem to understand for the- Pause. Real quick, real quick. That's another thing, too. You trap niggas, you little gangsters. A good 30% of y'all are informants. I don't give a fuck what you say. I'm going to leave it at that. Is how you fuck up a drug deal like you did so royally and don't have the good sense to get the fuck out of Philly. Because he's stupid. Fleeing the scene of a crime. Mm. You, you, you know, you know he, he's, he's really right. He's right, Titus. And you know it's even colder than that. Uh -oh. Them niggas you running with don't give a fuck about you. That's a fact. See, right now, you need to look out for yourself. Right now, you need to be worried about you and everybody that you love. Help us. Help you. Uh oh, he about to Go snitch 6 9 He about to go Takashi on these niggas. Fuck it. Uh-oh. I'll help y'all. Because y'all gonna help me. We'll put this nigga in wit set. As I told y'all, I didn't shoot nobody. I ain't kill nobody. You got the video. Shit got chaotic. I had to get the fuck out of there. 
But at work, that shit was Jarrell Jackson's work. Oh, yeah. you just gonna snitch like that? You do this a lot. Take girls out on yachts and uh -oh. treat them to fine dining. Yeah, all the time. <laughs> no, I'm joking. <laughs> Actually, uh, a buddy of mine lets me use his boat whenever I'm in town. It's pretty soothing, all right? It's all right, but it ain't got nothing on this Italian restaurant, Bistro Romano in Philly, baby. Okay, no argument from me. Thank you. Thank you. You been to Philly? No, never been. Wow. So what, what brought you to LA? Um, partly for work. I own a construction company and a buddy of mine from Orange County hired me to help him out with this, this housing development. And the other part? Uh-oh. I needed a change of scenery. To be honest with you, um, I lost my wife about a year ago. And everywhere I went in D.C. reminded me of her. Oh, Lord. He's trying to coincide with her losing Quadir. That's hilarious. I've completely... Oh, you rubbing on the leg? He giving her... It's okay, really, because I lost somebody close to me recently, too. You mind if I ask her? My boyfriend. Sorry, my fiance. We had just got engaged when he passed. Oh, okay, what happened? I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, he was shot because he was trapping? Oh. It's okay. <laughs> I'm so sorry for your loss. Did you have kids? No. You? Uh-oh. No. I mean, we we plan to have kids, but I had just started my company, and my wife decided she wanted to go back to school, so never quite got around to it. Mm-hmm. Life has a way of sometimes getting in the way of your intentions, huh? Mm-hmm. But... Oh! I like this. She no, gonna actually, end up giving them cookies. It's kind of a relief. Think about it. We both know each other's circumstances, and that uh -oh. takes away the pressure of us trying to force a relationship too soon. Uh -oh. That part. <laughs> oh, oh, wow. And my man is having a party tonight. I think we should slide through. Is there gonna be any food there? Cause every time we go to one of your homies house, all they ever have is Henny and Coke. Yes. It's gonna be a DJ, food, it's gonna be like four star or something. Okay, but don't have me out there hungry. I told you, I think it's actually catered, we straight. You think they gonna have popcorn shrimp? <laughs> Look, tonight, I'm gonna text you when I'm on my way, all right? Ooh, popcorn shrimp is so good. All right, and bring me some Twizzlers, too, when you leave, okay? He about to set her up. Yeah. Yeah. I got you. For real. Let me guess. Model boy in the background? For sure. Gun pointed. See? I told you we straight. Come on. I should be in I those boardrooms. I know, son. I knew it. Told you. In the background, gun pointed. Ain't no. Man. It's all set. It's cracking off tonight. And I'm going to take care of Lee and Bree. She going to bark like a dog by the time I get done with him. What's up? What's up? And I'm just checking. Pause real quick. Can I, just, can I just say something real quick? And I ain't going to get too political. Just a little philosophical. You know, this this is why I don't like the trap boys. The, that's why I'm against that whole culture. I don't like that drug shit. I don't like none of that shit. Street nigga. I don't like none of that shit. That shit is whack and half of y'all damn near informants anyway. But it's just, you know, I see these movies and it, it and the message is always at the end of the day, y'all dying, y'all going to jail. And to my women that be dealing with these niggas, the, it's always clear. That's why I kind of do like these movies because it's never a good ending. Number one and number two, it just shows y'all that it, we got a lot of movies that just be like, just in general, you can't date the black man because he's never protected you. Look at that. 
one boy is 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 about to snitch on his own little thing that he like you know what i'm saying and then we got jarrell easing his way into uh gina's panties and he about to get to that money and end up railroading her life too now, i'm not saying that gina's a little different because she's trying to date good brothers she's trying to date good people so i'm gonna leave her out of this one on, on that one but it just makes it look like black men ain't shit. Look at all of y'all. Every every black man in this in this movie ain't shit. For every single one of them. Got we got two snitches. We got two, and we got two hood trap niggas that's about to railroad all these chicks' lives. I can see it. It's about to go down. It's about to get ugly. Can I get one black good role model? Can I get one? And then the other one is a cop. We all know there ain't a bunch of women. <laughs> Ain't a bunch of black women chasing black cops. Like, like let, let's let's just throw that out. Like, come on now. So it's just like, eh, I'm I'm gonna leave it alone. I don't want to go too deep. Go ahead, play the movie. What you doing? I'm chilling. What's going on? Not too much. I mean, you just stand there. You ain't gonna let me in. No, I didn't even like that. I just I wasn't expecting you. Okay. So, is you gonna let me in? Mm -hmm. She be grubbing, y'all. Why are you calling me when my tennis match is on? You know I love Venus, Serena, and Coco. Ooh, good sir. I need you to come get me. Why? What's going on? I'm at this party with Dalvin, right? And ever since I got here, he's been acting real strange. Strange how? First of all, they ain't even got no food. Just some dry-ass chicken. Bria. One minute he's acting all nice, right? And trying to get me to do drugs. And when I said no, he got all hostile. He put his hands on you? No. I didn't let him get a chance. He started tripping. I'm upstairs in the storage room. I locked myself in here. Text me the address. I'm gonna be on my way. Okay. Uh-huh. Okay. Come in, it's open. Oh, shit. Hello? Sorry, I'm still getting dressed, but I'll be down in the This nigga is a sheep and wolf, a wolf and sheep clothing. Literally. Literally. This nigga got a, yeah! This nigga got on that motherfucking, he got a nice little uh, suit vest on and some roses. I'm done. I'm probably gonna mute the music. It's probably copyright. Really? This nigga doing like heroin? What the fuck is that? Stop playing with me, Bria! So what you been doing? And y'all probably like, see, I knew he was crazy. I'm glad she didn't get in a relationship yeah. with him. Of course, of course, the guy that wants a relationship is crazy yeah. as hell on the low. Just me. You know how that go. You cooking anything? No. Oh I got boy. To drink. Yep. Of course. What are you doing? I wasn't gonna find out. Find out what? You know who hit us the whole time, and you ain't say nothing. I don't know what you're talking about. Could have saved yourself. Now you gotta check. So what? You gonna kill me? Huh? You couldn't kill this pussy, so you gonna kill me. All right, go ahead, kill me. Gonna kill this pussy. Yeah. Gonna kill this pussy. Yo, you wanna get fucked one last time? Yeah. Are are you are you serious? Are you are you serious? I'm glad I'm glad the movie picked up because I was getting a little bored. Yeah, I probably was too. Are are you serious right now? So. But y'all, y'all love, y'all love it. I'm sure y'all love it. Girl, he pulled a gun on me and then he pulled the shit out of me. Girl. Nigga. She probably gonna kill his dumb ass. That's probably what's about to happen. Probably gonna, you know, he probably gonna bust, bust that thing, you know what I'm saying? And then she gonna bust the gun on his ass. And you know it's funny, like. We got so many trap boys and we got history of drug dope boys and gangsters where you can see mistakes. 
I'm a I'm a white collar brother, and I wouldn't make half of these mistakes if I was a fucking criminal. If that's the case, my nigga, just kill her or just tie her up. This nigga wanna try to be a nigga and get some ass before he kill her, before he gonna You know that's not gonna happen. Oh my god. I ain't gonna lie, it's, it's still a good movie, but this is a little bit more cringier than the first one now. I ain't gonna lie to y'all who productions come from whoever made this movie. Hi, Mark. What can I do for you? I'm sorry I didn't call sooner, but I would... I would hate myself if something happened to you because of this psycho. Psycho? Uh-oh. What are you talking about? Some guy, he ran up on me and beat me because I was seeing you. What? I'm still laid up in bed with three broken ribs on my face. Got my face is shit. Why would somebody do that? He's obsessed with you, Hud. Um, okay, so. What, what did he look like? like? He's a black guy. Uh, brown skin, six foot, six one, maybe. He had a beard. He's one of those tough guys, but not not the loud ones, the quite scary kind. Okay, um. Did you get his name? No. No. But he had an East Coast vibe to him. Uh oh. Okay, Mark, look, I have to go. Text me your address and I'll come by your house. Okay. We got London on the track, Philly. What the fuck is up? What's wrong? Uh -oh. I know this is really bad timing and I'm really sorry, but I have an emergency and I have to go right now. Well, I'll go with uh -oh. you. No, I have to go by myself, but lunch tomorrow on me. Please, I'm so sorry. Yeah, no, it's. You don't have to apologize. I understand things happen. Thank you. Just really unfortunate that uh, that our night had to end so abruptly. I know. I'm really sorry. It's all good. Uh -oh. At least let me see that dress one more time before I leave. Uh -oh. I mean, that's the least you can do, right? Okay. Gonna pull the guy out. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I'm sorry. Yo! Yo! Oh! Oh, no! Yo! He didn't have to do her like that! I almost, yo, I almost fucked that one green screen on that one. That nigga, I'm sorry, yo, pause! He did not have to ice her like that! He's like, yeah, let me see that dress one more time. She spun around. Wow! All right, all right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I, I'm against mine. I'm sorry. I never. I would never advocate or ever do no shit like that. It's a movie. Relax. But that. Come on. You didn't chuckle a little bit. Yo. I think I'm fucking stupid. Now I'm glued. Now. That's definitely copyright. I gotta mute that. What's going on in there? Oh. Just trying to get my bitch up out of there. Maybe you can help out. My bitch up out of there. Bria in there? Yeah. Wait, how you knowing that? That's her. Bria, he shook! Of course. You okay? You good. Let's go. Hey. I'm sorry, the reason, you know, I'm sorry. The reason why I didn't laugh as hard when he got punched because I knew that was going to happen. The other one I didn't know was going to happen. He deserved that. Yes, ladies, I'm on your, yes, he deserved to get punched. Gina didn't, okay? I'm sorry I laughed like that. I'm sure y'all like, ugh, fuck him, unsubscribed. I get it, but that shit was funny. This, I knew that, I knew she was going to fuck him up. When, she, when he touched her, I knew she was going to punch the shit out of him. And he deserved it. Wake your ass up. Ah. Come on, man. Why are you even tie her up? Get your ass up. Look, look at this shit. Get your ass up. Hey. Your little buddy Mark just had to come ruin everything, didn't he? Guess I gotta finish him off later. Uh, you hit me? Mm hmm. Why? Caught your ass good, huh? Look, Gina, you got Quadia's money. As far as I'm concerned, that's my money. And I need that. And I need uh -huh. to know who the fuck hit my truck with your cousin, Bria. Bria? How you know uh -huh. Bria? 
What are you talking about? Hey, we can play this game all day. I ain't got nothing but time. Matter of fact, I got 20 more ways that I can punch you in your face off rip. Or one or two things can happen. Either one, I can leave this house a little bit richer. Or two, your whole family can die. Let me go! Really? Really? You should have tied her up. Really? This is am I really about to witness a fight to the death? Oh, oh, little mama, you showed your cheeks? What? Okay. She gonna grab the gun and she gonna shoot him. Come on, man! Oh, come on, man! I mean, come, come on! Like, I, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. True to the game, the first one was was. I, it was. I'll give it three stars. This one is like two point five stars. When I started to predict what's about to happen, you losing me production. You losing me casting. Go ahead. Go ahead. So, I, come on, man. I don't want to kill you, but I will. Uh, fucking kill you. Oh, you. Bitch. You better hope I die. Oh, oh. bitch, I'm gonna fucking kill you. Oh. Bitch. Oh. You had your chance, you dummy. This shit don't even have to be all about the money. Uh, Fuck it. It is what it is. Uh, no. Nope. Uh, <laughs> are, are you serious? Are you serious with that? Do you think you're going, bitch? Yeah. Like I said, really, we got a triple threat going on. Really, really. <laughs> Bria, you not gonna help? Dudes ain't gonna break it up. Drop me in my motherfucking phone. See, this is what I'm talking about. Black men, they beat. They're so rambunctious. They hitting women. They're hitting the women. No black dudes came to her aid when she got punched in the face. The black man never protected you. The black man never did. But the white guy did. The white guy protected you. He called you and gave you a heads up. I, I'm not even... I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to go... I'm sorry. I don't want to offend nobody. I'm not going to go political. I'm not going to go philosophical. I just... I just want you to... Under, I just want you to open your eyes when you see shit like this, ladies. That's all. That's all I'm saying. We're not all like this, okay? I'm, I'm, leave, I'm sure you know that we're not all like this, but I'm just, it's just very, very, like, you, this, this is kind of a man-hating movie right now. I just want to let you know that. This is a black man holocaust right now, okay? I'm going to leave, I'm going to leave that alone. Go ahead, man. That shit, huh? <laughs> what the fuck is the money? Nigga, you about to kill her. Why didn't he tie her up? Nigga, you not Michael Myers. You know what, too, Pauls, really quickly? He's stupid. He could he didn't even have to do all that. He could have waited patiently. Cause the white boy don't remember, probably don't even remember what home he looked like. He could just be he can call a race car and be like, he I, that wasn't me. Maybe do he, he is he saying I look like him because he was black? I wasn't it wasn't me. You know, he could have he could have got out of that. She had a feeling it was could it was him, but she didn't know. She could have. He could have waited a little bit more patiently. He could have tied her up when he punched her, when he haymakered her ass. Yeah. I, uh, uh. I know they ain't gonna do her, Gina, like this. She gonna make it out of this. If they end up killing, you gotta be fucking kidding me right now. So Quadir didn't die? Okay, never mind. The 2.5 just went back up to three-star movie. I, I revamped my last statement. Go ahead. I want to see this. 
Really? My boy didn't die. Okay. So he gonna be the hero of the day. He came back from the dead. Very interesting. He gonna hate on the picture. Oh, I thought he was gonna smash it. Wake up. Wake up. My nigga, look around the crib. See what he gonna do? See, this is the thing. See, this is this is another thing. He gonna have to do street justice. I'm sorry, I'm gonna let it play. Cause the thing is, he's a trap boy. Himself, he was drugs and money too. And number two, he faked his own death. When you fake your own death, that's five years in jail too. So guess what? He can't call the police. Hi, what's your name? Quadir. Okay, they come there and do the police report. Even if they, even if he called the police and they got, they got Jarrell up out of here. They locked him up. They shot him. Whatever it was. Okay, what's your guy's name? Quadir. What's your last name? You guys got ID? Quadir. Quadir. Richardson. Uh. Okay. They put him in the database. So he died, faked his own death, five years in jail, dumb black bitch. Come on, man. So he can't even call the cops as a backup. Now he has to do this on his own. See me, I whooped his ass, killed him, and called the cops just in case shit went left. I'll be right back. I promise. Okay, I hope that you're strapped. He probably is, he's a black man, just saying. It ain't gonna be that simple though. It's gonna be a fight scene. It's gonna be a fight scene. Quadir gonna get his ass whooped. Probably still got the shot wound in his stomach. And then, then Quadir's gonna magically win. I would've just shot him right there. Come on, man. Like you've seen the ghost. Shoot him, man. Don't you think that's a little bit too easy? Oh, Lord. Why don't you get your hands dirty? Nigga, you didn't fight me? Isn't this poetic? You didn't fight me? Fuck that! <laughs> Let me guess, Gina gonna wake up and save Quadir? Okay, I like a little fight scene.
You don't say. Always the hero loses for some reason. And then Gina's gonna come out of nowhere and save the day. Watch. And now I gotta kill you again. Take that long for someone to run out of breath. But Respect that. Shot that nigga anyway, just in case. Oh, you lost your cousin. Okay. My boy got his redemption. Look at this. Gina, baby. It's me, it's quite dear. It's me. You're not dreaming. After you shot, after I got shot in the stomach, it was best that I stay dead so you to protect you and myself and, and start over. That's what that's gonna be. So, okay, I was about to, I know this nigga ain't about to leave. Okay, so that is how it ended. Um, I had to cut off the, the music and all that, and I'm probably at a pause screen, but catch a Freeman TV. I hope y'all enjoyed that. I'm probably gonna cut it up in the two reviews. It's the finale, the ending. I thought it was a good movie, you know, but um, it looks like this is going to be a trilogy because they didn't explain anything. He's going to let her wake up. I'm sure I'm sure there's going to be a true to the game three, so look out for that. But yeah, if you like this, subscribe, follow, comment. You know, I know some. I know sometimes my views might get a little, you know, people going to disagree with stuff. That's fine. I still love you regardless. It's all good. But I'm out. Bye. Passion fruit. Catch a frame in TV, better known as the truth. Somebody hit the fire alarm, I'm about to spit in this booth. She 5'10, light skin, thick, plus she cute. She got a body resume, and I'm trying to recruit. Hit the gym, hit the shower, then I hop in my suit. Army type, fall in line, all that ass hit the boot. Freeman focused on the money at the bank, counting loot. Uh, and now we talking, and now we dating, and she walking, and I'm waiting. Premature relations without being patient. Before this lust, it was a little conversation, but now she hooked on the potent stimulation. We falling to pieces, I'm the shit like pieces. We on point like an old man, pants with the creases. And the 